What's up guys? So I just wanted to say thanks for checking out the video. Um, in this, I'm going to be playing through Hogwarts Legacy and this is going to be a playthrough here on the channel. Uh, so I just wanted to say thanks for checking it out and I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. And I don't really have much more for an intro. You know, I've been looking forward to this game for a really long time now. And it, even though it's got a lot of controversy around it for some reason, I haven't really been following along too much with all that. Um, but for whatever reason, I don't know why this game seems really awesome. And I haven't spoiled too much for myself, so a lot of this is going to be, you know, my, you know, first impressions and reactions to everything. So, but yeah, once again, just a huge thank you for checking out the video. And I guess we'll just jump right into it. Um, I am going to be reading as much as I can and, you know, trying to do as much side content as I can. So, uh, definitely been looking forward to this game for too long to not go through it and, and try to experience everything. So... We are pleased to inform you that you have been accepted at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry as a fifth year student. Terms begin on the 1st of September. Preliminary supplies have been collected for you and will accompany you on your journey to the castle. As you may be aware, the decree for the reasonable restriction of underage sorcery prohibits the use of magic by those under the age of 17 outside of school. However, due to your unique circumstances, the Ministry has graciously agreed to allow Professor Elazar Fig to help you hone your spellcasting before escorting you from London to the castle for the start of the term feast and the sorting ceremony. Yours sincerely, Professor Weasley, Deputy Headmistress. Alright. Oh, we get... Wow, so... They give you a pretty good selection. And... I think I'm going to go with this. I'm not going to mess around too much with the character creation. Um, I'm not really sure how much this is actually going to matter. And it's all personal stuff anyway, so... I think everything looks pretty good so far. I am going to mess with the complexion a little bit. And... I'm not going to do, like, clear skin. I will... I think I'm just going to do a little bit of freckles. And no scars or anything like that. And you know what? We'll uh messing with the eye color here. I really like that. But oh yeah, we'll just leave that. No, nah, like that's a nice curve. And that kind of matches my own, so I think I'll go with that. And we're gonna be going with voice one. That's the, I think that's the male voice. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. That sounds a little It was wonderful. Interesting. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. Uh yep, that sounds definitely more, you know, like Harry Potter, honestly. And I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. No, the pitch just sounds so off, something. so weird. So we'll just go with the normal pitch there in the middle. And we are gonna be playing on hard. Hopefully that's not a mistake. I really hope I can get through the game without, you know too much of a challenge but and then for the name here I think I'm just gonna do um, actually yeah we'll just do the channel name whoops I think that's a pretty fitting name for us and we are a wizard so we'll go ahead and start now I am NOT gonna be talking too much during the cutscenes um, but we'll see. I'm gonna, I don't want to spoil too much or get in the way of too much. So. Ah, it appears we are almost ready to depart. It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spell casting. I presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Well, I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand wand. You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me before the term begins. Oh, <laughs> Eleazar! George! Glad my rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. I've apparated to more vaguely defined destinations than this. <laughs> I love how well spoken I may they are. Have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some theater goers in the West End. <laughs> wow. It's been much too long. When I received your owl, I must uh, say I... Best not speak here, Eleazar. Mm. Of course. Wow. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We have a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Wonderful idea. As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not at all, sir. 
After you. Not at all, sir. Ages since I've been to the castle. Would be good to see the old pile of rocks. He sees something. Okay, I'm, I'm not sure what they're called, but I know you can only see them if you've seen or experienced some kind of death, right? Um, I don't know what they're called. Maybe we'll find out. But whatever they are, they're, I think that's what's pulling the carriage. And I don't know who that was. Warner Bros. Games. So excited for this. Glad I caught you before you left for Scotland. <laughs> Just barely. <laughs> and who is your traveling companion? A new student. New? Yes, sir. I'm starting school as a fifth year. How extraordinary. It is indeed. None of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late. Nor have I. Of course, as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now, the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins. Well, you couldn't have asked for a better mentor. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional teacher, he's also a remarkably intuitive and gifted wizard. Mr. Osric nice. is prone to flattery. I dare prone say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the Ministry. <laughs> no doubt. Have you seen this? Oh, wow. Goblin Rebellion Truth or Goblin Book? Opinions differ as to Goblin. how great a threat Ranrock really is. Wow. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, I believe he is a significant oh, no. threat. And it was your wife, Eleazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? How? <sighs> she wrote to me about Ranrock before she died, wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I received this. It was the last thing she sent me, Eleazar. It came to me via her owl, but with no correspondence. I can only assume that she had to get rid of it quickly to keep it safe. Presumably from Ranrock. I cannot open it. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. It looks like goblin metal. That symbol. What's that glow? I don't see a glow. Nor do I. Oh, wow. So he's got some kind of gift or power. Merlin's beard. How did you... Wait. And by him, I mean me. Us. <laughs> oh. Dude, that's, that's so badass. That guy just, that guy just got killed. Dude. Dude. Oh yeah. See, yeah, he can see him now. Oh, that's, that's awesome. That's really, that's really cool. Pretty good attention to detail there. got killed there dude that was that was way too close wow. are you all right squirrel there or something you're hurt perhaps a bit take this it's Wigan world potion Wigan that stuff world. will write you in a second will it oh 
Takes a second. What nice. happened? Poor George. I can't believe he. What the hell got into that damn thing? Attacking a carriage midair? A typical dragon would never. Professor? <sighs> Sir, where are we? I'm not sure. What's going on with his coat? <laughs> but that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? Port An key. item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. So I think I might have to mess with my settings real quick. Yeah, we'll cap it. Might have to... Hopefully that... It seems a little bit better, but... Oh, wow, that's bright. Really beautiful game. I mean... He take us farther from London than the carriage traveled. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. So, those ruins. Do you think he really knows his there? geography? I do. This has wow. not been the day either of us expected. No. Nope. But Miriam sent that port key to George for a reason, and I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Absolutely. Let's see if we can find a path, however faded it may be. Mind your step. Where do you suppose your wife got the poor key that brought us here? A good question. Miriam spent years searching for evidence of a long-forgotten form of ancient magic. Ancient magic? Yes. A powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. Hogwarts Castle was built by and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. I don't know where she came into possession of the port key. Wow. But I am certain it, it was so to beautiful. do with that search. Ah, there's the path down below. This way. But sir, why was your wife searching for evidence of lost magic? Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world. Spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. Very true. With great magic is that ice? comes great responsibility. It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that wand work you were practicing. Focus on the center. Yeah, Wow, they did not do a good job of trying to protect the path. Excellent. Unless they only wanted, like, um, you know, wizards to get by. Use your camera to select an active target. Some players prefer to select targets and move the avatar with the same stick by disabling camera relative targeting and settings. I mean, yeah, we'll have to mess around with that later on. Um, whoa. That was a bit rougher than I'd expected. You could break the pots. I wonder if they drop anything. It's like Zelda. I'm gonna break every pot I see. Improving with every cast. Thank you, sir. Is it? Ah, up there. Oh. What's over here? Chest. 48 gold? Silver? Well, not silver. Um, I'm not sure We're if the currency is now. called. I'll it's figure just it out. Ahead. Steady yourself! I wonder how skilled you have to be to actually fix 
that much at once. I suspect they valued their privacy. Their that privacy. Poor key led us here for a reason. Let's have a look around for anything that seems out of place. Okay. The mini map shows your surroundings with the icon in the middle. This icon is your current objective. Press and hold up on the D pad to toggle. Professor Fig and I have traveled via port key to a remote cliffside in the Scottish Highlands. We need to explore the mysterious ruins that we suspect the port key was meant to lead us to. Okay. Professor, yeah, that's pretty, uh... It's a mural of some kind. We, we already mm. knew that. Perhaps our host was a noted seer. Interesting. Okay, we gotta go over here, I think. Hmm. Professor, this statue... This may have been his home. He's pondering the orb. Maybe, hopefully we get to ponder an orb at some point. That enchanted crystallized stone again. Oh, wow. But what could it be blocking? What's this? Oh, Professor cool. Fig! Professor... Oh, he's, he's booking it, dude. Oh, that's really cool. How odd. Why would someone have conjured that enchanted stone here? And how is there a room behind it? What room? My controller's going crazy right anything. now. There's that glow again. Like the glow on the port key container. The glow. Oh. I'll investigate it. What in Merlin's name? Oh, weird. Godric's heart. Oh. Where are we? Dude. I don't believe it. Wait. Are we in the bank? Hello? Goblin banker? Yeah, dude. We're in the bank. That's awesome. <clears throat> I love the dialogue and the court the what's the word? I don't even know what I'm what word I'm looking for. Oh, this guy's creeping me be. out. Oh my god. What is that shit eating grin? He has uh, just a moment. <laughs> Dude. Uh, goblins are kinda of freaky. Oh, what is going on in my head? Okay. That's a shit eating grin if I've ever seen one. Welcome to Gringotts Wizarding Bank. Vault number 12, I presume. <laughs> Precisely. Precisely. The key? Mm hmm? Your wife's port key. Oh, yes, of course. This way, then. Stay close. About to go for a ride. After you. Uh, keep your hands inside the cars if you don't wish to lose them. <laughs> How many volts are there? Hundreds. In fact, you'll see quite a few on our way to vault number 12. As we speak, we're just beneath the main lobby. The vaults you see now are the newest. Are private entrances to the bank common at Gringotts? 
They are most uncommon. Only one with great wealth or power, or both, could have arranged for such a service. You want to take a breath? A what? That waterfall washes away all enchantments. It's a security measure. Experienced the thief's downfall before, have you? Heard of it? These are the lower vaults that we're passing now. How deep are we going? Vault number 12 was commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded over four centuries ago. It resides in the deepest part of the bank. Settle in. We've quite this is a, a crazy to bank. Go. It's so cool. I get to we get to explore it like this, though. So. He looks Number. angry. Vault 12. Momentous day. <laughs> hmm. Vault 12. On your way. Dude, how did he not hear us? He watches over the oldest section of the bank. Rare anyone goes there anymore. I'm sure. Nobody alive, really. If it's the oldest part of the bank. And that other goblin, he's he's sketchy. Something's Here going on with him. Are. He's up to something, that's for sure. When was the last time this vault was accessed? A goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. In that time, no one has visited Vault 12. Until today. Okay. He works. Vault 12. Thank you for your help. Something dumb. Sit right with me about this. Any secrets? Nope. Nothing at a quick glance that I can see. What do you suppose we should be looking for? I'm not sure. Secrets. Sir, I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait. Best of luck. Oh no. Professor? That was certainly unexpected. Luckily there's something going on with that door. Let me think. That wall. There must be something here. Hmm. Revelio, perhaps. Revelio? Yes. Classic a revealing spell. revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and uh, focus. Steady your wand and guide it along the symbol path to learn the spell. Press the corresponding input when prompted to accelerate your wand's motion along the symbol's path. Okay. Oh, that's really cool that you get to play like a little mini game to learn the spells. That's awesome. Pretty simple, but I like it. There, I saw something. Move a bit closer and try again. All right. Oh. A door. Well, that's this a vault star. holds many secrets. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to. I do. So are we not going to take the gold? That has the same glow as the one I saw on the pool key container. Are we not going to take if this? If what you can see reveals the way forward, okay. then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. Let's go. Lumos. Where are we now? This is no ordinary vault. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean, earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I do. Well, yeah. But to what end, I can't say. Stay close. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. 
not out of Gringotts. I see something up ahead. What is it? That glow again, but on the floor. When I moved towards the glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Yes, sir. I'm fine. You seem to have caused the floor to change. That statue? What statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Oh, dude. What the hell? There must be something to that reflection you're seeing. Revelio, I presume oh, this is what you saw I gotta reflected use Revelio. in the floor. It took me long it enough. It is. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Wait. When you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm. Perhaps you should cast Lumos. Okay, I gotta learn this. Easy. Lumos. Well done. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. That's really cool. Oh no. This can't be good. Look out! Protego! Protego. Okay. We're gonna get some combat training in. Oh wow. This guy's putting in some work. So I gotta use Protego. Attack me. Attack me. That feels really Stay good close. so far. Stay close. So. Professor. Oh no. Professor Fig. Professor, where are you? Lost this him. isn't good. We gotta go where this way. Where am I supposed to go? What's happening? The wisps of magic. Ah, that's where they're leading. A glow again. Revelio. I suppose I'm on my own this time. Oh, there's a... Oh. Dude. It seems I have no Three choice. Once. I'm going to have to fight my way out of here. Yeah. Oh, I do. I fight. Or I hit that mess. Revelio. Stupid fight. I gotta focus. Okay. Hold triangle during Protego to stun enemies with Stupefy, right? Okay. Yeah, I've been doing that. A little too early on that. I gotta wait. Stupid fun. Stupid fun. Stupid fun. Cool. Stupid fun. Can I stupefy somebody else? Stupid fun. Oh, I didn't even see him attack. 
They do give you a prompt though, which is kind of nice. Oh no. Not perfect, but we got it done. Wow. So the combat Lumos. seems pretty challenging just for, you know, a tutorial. Definitely gonna be pretty awesome once we get once we learn more spells. Got our way out of here now, I think. What is that? Oh, sorry about that. How did he what get here? What is this place? I don't know. But I found this floating above that basin. That is no mere basin. That is a pensive. Pensive. For viewing memories. Oh, cool. We're gonna get to view some memories? I wonder. So that's a memory. Follow my lead. You got it. I love the soundtrack to this game so far. They can do so much oh, cool stuff well with magic. Perhaps too well. I wonder if the path we've created may be impossible to I follow. Am. It will only be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic as I can. Your ability to see what others cannot ancient will magic. not be enough, Percival. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do anything to obtain. Yes. And if we are correct, Charles, the witch or wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge and the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all At that least we can. You, you would hope, right? That's what you're seeing. The glow. That surrounded them. Yes, sir. Astonishing. Can I see ancient magic? magic? Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed, but could never. Nice. Miriam, and perhaps George, died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And Rest you, in peace, George. Seems, are the key to understanding why. We were... It all looks rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's oh. coming. Who were they? I don't know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in there. I was right. Ranrock. Seems my reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's Vault. And why are you here? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here and we can let bygones be bygones. <coughs> I don't trust Sir, this guy. They had the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I... I only meant that 
the instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. I was to grant access only to one with the key, and you didn't have them. Damn, that I seems kind of harsh. For traitors. Now, where were we? I'm not giving you anything. Hmm. Well, perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. <laughs> Oh, wow. Dude, he's powerful. Okay, so the room is reacting to the magic. Oh, my God. That's kind of epic. Oh, we got to get out of here, man. Woods now. Are you all right? Never Fight, better. Sir. I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. Yeah, he's powerful. Where are we? <laughs> it can't be. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both. Wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. Wow. Okay. Oh, I love that. That's so cinematic. I can't wait. I hope we get to explore around here. That's so cool. Make it a little bit more cinematic. Nice. So that's the prologue. That's awesome. It sucks that we already got had to see somebody die, but you know they're just uh, coming out swinging. You know, they're not gonna they're not gonna give oh, us any good. gobbledygook. We haven't you know missed I mean? the sorting ceremony. I'm no expert, but that seems more appropriate. Now, I need to study this locket as soon as I can, but first I must contact the Ministry. They need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Of course, sir. Thank you. Ready for the sorting ceremony? Yep. Oh. So he was about to give a speech or something. Phineas Nigellus Black. Oh no. Prepare yourself to meet the headmaster. Fig. Nice of you to join us. The sorting ceremony is over. There were... Complications. Complications? It seems the goblin Enough. problem has... Goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig. And I'm rapidly oh, losing whatever patience I had left. How can he be so... 
if blunt. you're lucky, we might I'm still be able to, to get you sorted this evening. Why would he lie? That's just obnoxious <clears throat> to me. I'll be in touch. Just dismissing that kind of turmoil as a rumor. Wow. Unless he's like, unless he actually knows what's going on and he's just playing dumb. Professor Weasley. Because he's obviously a smart guy. I mean, to he's got to be. So now we get to pick our Welcome. house. You're just in or, time. Uh, Have a seat. Get to choose what, where we are. Nice. Ah, yes. A bit older than the others, aren't you? You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. Um, I can't wait to explore. Yeah, I mean, classes sound fun, but I do want to explore. I'm looking forward to exploring Hogwarts and the world beyond the castle and grounds. Mmm, indeed. Much can be gleaned by having an adventurous spirit. But your professors have a great deal to teach you as well. Definitely. Mm. I wonder. Mm. Mm. I detect something <laughs> in you. A certain sense, sense of... of... Mm. <laughs> what is it? Mm. Curiosity. Ambition. Is it ambition? I may seem single-minded, but it is important to go after what you want from life. Mm, interesting. Wow. That's, You've recently that's learned that you possess a rare ability. I detect a growing sense of ambition. Oh. An eagerness for power. Okay. Perhaps you belong in Slytherin. Slytherin. Slytherin House, known for cunning, ambition, and a hunger for power. Well, I mean, if the hat thinks we should go into Slytherin, um, I mean, I don't want to be in Slytherin, so I think I'm going to go with Ravenclaw. And you've a ready mind. Quick to learn. Yeah, we'll go with Ravenclaw. I would choose you Gryffindor, but... Ravenclaw! Hmm. I want to learn more about the other houses, you know? Oh, and one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. What, really? Enough! It's not as though I've banned flying altogether. So they just threw that in there to kind of explain why me. Quidditch isn't in the game. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Quite an entrance. Okay. It's lovely to meet you. I'm Professor Weasley. Would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As deputy headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. Hell yeah. Let's go get some sleep. It's quite uncommon for a student to begin as a fifth year. Might be a bit of a challenge, but one I'm sure you're up for. I am, Professor. This Definitely. is the entrance to the Ravenclaw common room. You must solve a riddle to enter. I won't oh, be of much shit. help, I'm afraid. This sort of thing has always confounded me. A riddle. Who lived longer? The ghost or the poltergeist? 
ghost or a poltergeist. Hmm. A non-being can never have been. Okay. I mean, we got well it right, done. but... Now, go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you So tomorrow. what? If I don't get it I right, I just I just can't go to bed. For your first class. Is that how Thank it is? You, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your Seems kind of harsh. Oh, sorry. Sleep you well. you got to sleep outside tonight, buddy. Oh no. That's that's gorgeous. Wow. What a view. I can't wait to start exploring. Part of the reason why I picked Ravenclaw is because I kind of like, like blue, gone. right? Let's head this to the just corner. looks amazing. Just do some light exploration in here. Oh wow, a lot of books. All those are those daisies. Tea set. What a dude! That bed. Oh my god, it's making me tired just looking at it. Kind of. Loki looks a little uncomfortable though. All right, can we go downstairs? Anything down? I know this is the wrong way, but um, oh, okay, level three lock. Okay, so we got a ways to go before we mess with that. This is somebody else's room. bathrooms um can i just go into the stalls oh god no i can use the bathroom i can just flush the toilet okay of course i'm just gonna go straight to the bathroom okay <laughs> i mean who doesn't you know go to the bathroom first thing in the morning right moment can I crouch I don't really like knights anymore after what happened I suppose some introductions introduce in yourself to Emmy Everett and Samantha Everett one moment watch this uh, what is this someone threw a dumb box <coughs> Oh no. It's a troublemaker. That wasn't quite the reaction I wanted. Oh well. Right. What did you hope would happen? I suppose I hoped it would lighten the mood. Ravenclaws can be a bit on edge the first day of class. I'm Everett, by the way. You seem downright calm next to some of these characters. And you survived My a rather hat's harrowing trip so here. Right now. Um, actually a tad nervous. I'm a little I'm I'm looking forward to, to my here. first day. Ready for classes to start. Good. Glad to hear it. Truly, there's no reason to be nervous. Most no professors are reason. firm but fair. I mean, not all of the tricks I play are as simple as a tossed dung bomb, and I'm still here. Wait, did you say most professors are firm but fair? This guy's <laughs> a did, character. But probably best I let you judge for yourself. I do tend to push their limits. Yeah, I can tell. I should wander off before someone traces that dung bong back to me. Dude. Nice meeting you. You too, You did it in the middle of everybody. Like, everybody's watching you. I guess nobody's watching you, but... Oh, that's so creepy. <laughs> Gotta talk to him. Deep breath. Why, hello. Would you like to take a look? Yeah. I love astronomy. Oh my god, those books flying around. Day. Well, except for stars like Sirius, Canopus, Vega, and Arcturus. I'm Amit. Pleasure to have you in Ravenclaw. Amit. Never met someone who's been uh, so close say to before? a dragon I'm, before. I don't Can't say I'd recommend it, frankly. Amit. It's nice to meet you, Amit. I take it you like astronomy. Oh, yes. Yeah. So much to Me be too. learned from the stars. Like, seriously, I love astronomy. So there's something about the open air and night sky above the tower. It's invigorating. You will adore astronomy. Professor Shaw is incredibly knowledgeable. I find the stars fascinating. I hope astronomy's on my schedule. Sounds interesting. 
I have good news for you. You are most definitely taking astronomy. It is required for all fifth years. You will be enthralled Dude. with the tower. Now I'm kind Plus, of excited to go to class. Plus, can show you things you never dreamed of. I suppose I'll see you in class then. Yes. Oh, and speaking of class, better get to my first one of the year. Nothing like the smell of fresh parchment, is there? Be seeing you. It would be really interesting to to actually learn how the wizards think of the universe, right? If, if hopefully they do kind of touch base on that, even if it's just like minor details, but I, I would love to learn what they think about the entire universe. I'm not sure this is the right spot. It's going to be interesting. I want him to be in the perfect place. A place he'll be happy with. But I can't seem to find it. Great golden gobstones. I want him to thrive here. Golden gobstones? <laughs> My own little expression. I bought this Dittany seedling from home and I so want him to feel cozy. Dittany is amazing, isn't it? So much healing power in such a little plant. <laughs> I've a bit wow. of a thing for plants, as you can see. <laughs> Pleased to meet you. I'm Samantha. Nice to meet you, Samantha. Is Disney used in Wiganwell potion? It is. Wow. Looks like someone's been studying up on their potion making. Actually, Professor Fig told me about the Wiganwell potion. Of course. I heard you were studying with him before term. He's an enigma, Fig. Teaches about theory. It seems to know a lot about practical magic. Yeah, he's very knowledgeable. Professor Fig does know a great deal about, um, different forms of magic. Well, I hope he told you about more than Wiganweld. You've lots to catch up on, I'm sure. Do most students grow their own ingredients? Is it common practice for students to grow their own ingredients? Oh, yes. In fact, our herbology teacher, Professor Garlic, encourages it. And I don't think nice. Professor Sharp, our potions master, cares where you get so many your herbs. ingredients as long as your brews are all perfect. Isn't it Hufflepuffs who like plants? I mean, that's just kind of a stupid question, right? It was nice to meet you, Samantha. Like, anybody good can luck like with plants, your right? Thank you. And good luck to you too on your first day. Good. Hey there, I'm in Ravenclaw. Professor Weasley is looking for you just outside. You would best not keep her waiting. Are there any other secrets here, though? Like, anything interesting? That is so cool. Wow. Maybe we'll head upstairs real quick, just kind of poke our head around, see what's going on. Oh, anything in here? Oh. Oh. Chest? Level one lock. All right. Oh my god, what's up there? Wait, can I play that piano? I sent a love letter to Imelda Reyes once, but I think she thought I was making fun of her because she's been rude to me ever since. When I said she was outspoken, I meant it as a compliment. That's so cool. Level one lock. So the door at the top of the tower is level one, but the chest by the bathroom is level three. What the heck? I always thought it was level Dude, I'm like at a fancy restaurant right now, man. This is some classic music. Oh my god. All right, let's let's move on. morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts? I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of wow. your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls? Yes, oh. your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. 
After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Sweet. Oh. Here you are. That's awesome. What is it? That's so cool. What is it? <laughs> oh. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. Oh, it dude. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's, that's epic. expected of a fifth year. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. Dude. It's a top tier gift. Thank you. Thank you, Top Professor, tier. But what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. Okay. Lead the way. This way. Follow Professor Weasley. The guide will give you opportunities what are you to doing? practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding lore. Dude, she looks kind of out of it right now. Dude. What the... What is she doing? Are you okay? I'm gonna bump into her. Uh. <laughs> Okay. Kind of weird. A little creeped out. I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Yeah, I bet. Why don't you cast Revelio on this bust? Okay. And see what details Revelio. the field guide can provide. Collect. Ravenclaw bust. This bus created in honor of Ravenclaw House resides in the lofty Ravenclaw Tower. Dude. Field guide challenges are the only way to acquire experience points. This is your wizarding level. XP earned from challenges increases your level and power. Your field guide tracks your current challenge progress. Select the challenges menu to continue. Okay. Collecting your first guide page unlocked a new challenge category. New challenges you unlock throughout your adventure will appear here. Select field guide pages to continue. Combat quest exploration field guide pages and the room of requirement. Okay. Each challenge has tiers. Special rewards unlock at each tier you complete from appearances to critical upgrades. Rewards must be claimed. Come back often to collect rewards. Okay. Got it. So now I can pause and okay, I got my inventory. And okay, I might have to actually change where the camera is here because I don't want to get to get in the way of that. I'm trying to be, I wanted to the camera to be, you know, as yeah. I just my brain is not working today. I don't want it to be too intrusive. You know what I mean? Okay, so inventory. Beasts, quest items, notes, resources, okay. Collections, tools, enemies, 67 enemies. Appearances, Revelio pages. There's 150 of them. Oh, what is this? Oh, okay. Um, the one we just got. Beasts, recruit, uh, rescuable beasts you have encountered. Brooms, 13 different brooms, ingredients, conjurations, wand handles, and traits. That's so cool. Challenges, right? And the map. Oh, wow, dude, I love the map. That is so cool. We just have Hogwarts here. The Great Hall. South Wing. Astronomy Wing? Wow. Wow. The wing of Hogwarts comprising the Astronomy Tower. The highest spire in Hogwarts. Okay. Dude, that's really cool. Wow. Attend your first day at Hogwarts. So what's all this? 
main all assignments relationships side the path to Hogwarts okay dude that's awesome this field guide is pretty sick clever isn't it yeah. Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that, inside and outside of the castle. Oh yeah, I wanted to check something. Um, so right now I have it on fidelity, right, for the graphical settings, and I want to know, like, how much worse um, fidelity with ray tracing. <laughs> okay. Oh, I have to reboot it. performance so I wonder how much worse this looks huh no time to waste you've classes to attend okay let me just switch it back real quick. Um, go to settings. I forgot I keep using the touchpad. We'll go back to fidelity. Okay, so there's a little bit of a difference, I think. A little bit more atmospheric, for sure. I'm not sure if my frames are actually taking a huge hit, though. Reveal. Rebellion. Oh. I'm like already getting sidetracked. Oh, what is this? Ah, good timing. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use blue flames to get around a bit quicker. Your nice. field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. We discovered blue flames, fast travel points. You can open the map at any time to fast travel to any lo uh, discovered blue flames. <laughs> okay. Hogwarts is divided into two main areas. The left side of the map is where students and professors live and includes the house common rooms and the great hall. Select the Grand Staircase region to continue. Okay. In this view, you can see the flue flames available in that region. Green flames represent flames you have discovered, including your own house common room. Reveal undiscovered flames. Okay. The right side of the map is where you'll find academic points of interest, including the Astronomy Tower, Library, and Greenhouses. Select the Library. This one? Professor Weasley has unlocked the Central Hall flu flames for you. To rotate. Dude. That's so cool. So she can just unlock them for me? Why not give them all to me? I mean, look, come on. And here we are. Whoa. Quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. Really? Wow, this is epic. Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive. Our King's Cross Station, so to speak. Yeah. Well, that's awesome. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Thank you, Professor. What's Hogsmeade? You mentioned Hogsmeade, Professor. Hogsmeade is the only all-wizarding village in Britain and is home to an array of shops and pubs. You should be able to find all of the school supplies you require in Hogsmeade. You will also, I imagine, enjoy many a butterbeer there with friends in due course. Can you tell me more about the Defense Against the Dark Arts class? Defense Against the Dark Arts, as the name implies, focuses on how to defend oneself against the evils that lurk beyond these walls. Yeah, we're gonna need walls. that. A mastery of Defense Definitely Against the Dark that. Arts is required for those who aspire to become Auras. 
Fortunately, we are lucky to have the ever gifted Professor Heckert in charge of our students' education Professor in Hecate. that regard. Can you tell me more about Charms class? What will I learn in Charms class? Exactly what you might expect. Spells, Spells charms, charms jinxes, jinxes. All terribly useful. Okay. I think you will enjoy Professor Ronan. He's a clever and entertaining wizard and a talented teacher. Sweet. Thank you, Professor Weasley. Yeah, a seriously. lot to absorb on your first day. And you have much to learn. Happily, Let's your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. Um, I'm afraid there isn't. I guess I kind of have to be respectful to Professor Fig, right? Just kind of, you know, fly, but... I'm, you know what? No, I'm not. I'm not going to do it. We did take a bit of a detour on the way here. Ended up exploring some ruins and... I shouldn't say more. Exploring ruins? Well, I presume Professor Fig has his reasons for keeping the details to himself for now. Speak of the devil. Oh, wow. Professor Fig. Bro. Your ears must have been burning. Oh? You don't understand. Yes. You she squeezed the truth out of me. Fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic it seems hmm well i'm just glad you both arrived in one piece perfectly good boats and carriages to hogwarts and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon i wouldn't say i chose the dragon's path professor rather unfortunately it would seem that it chose us very well yep enough chit chat i need it's to get to class myself might i rely on you professor fig to explain the details of the field guide's map of course. Thank you. All right. Good luck today. And remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you. I will. And invaluable to me, as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, really? Professor. That's kind of weird. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both weird. classes today, and I'll explain more about those Better assignments not write anything. I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you, you know, to Hogsmeade for those Interesting in that, in that book. Okay. Professor Fink. It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you and Professor Weasley talking about exploring ruins? I hope I didn't say too much. She caught me off guard. I didn't tell her anything else about our travels here. I will say, I think she suspects we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your so time I'm gonna have than to she lie. would approve of. Even and more. she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable What's the as reason you are, for being so I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well trained. Seriously, like why can't we tell Happily, them about it? You have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. I love how speaking of um, guides, we're not just like and questioning so that him I may about avoid why he's being so secretive. Not so subtle reproof we're from just Professor going along Weasley. With it. Why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guide's map? Unfold it and have a look. Okay. You can track available quests from the map. This represents main quests. Completing main quests will further the story, unlocking new features and grant XP. Some quests are locked by spell or level requirements. In these cases, you will need to be a required level or have the required spell to activate the quest. New spells can be earned by completing professor, uh, professor's assignments or as the quest rewards. Or as quest rewards. Okay. Okay, can I talk? 
Track a quest with X to continue. Charms class. The field guide map shows Professor Rowan's class in the astronomy wing. This castle is enormous. I may need to use the charmed compass and the field guide to help me find my way. And defense against the dark arts. So I am more interested in the charms class. But I, I do want to get the, you know, the... Well, actually, I guess I'm kind of interested in both. So I'll just, I'll just start with this one. We'll save the best for last. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when okay. I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. Okay. So, gotta be some secrets around here, right? This cannot possibly be difficult to see. Go that way. Revelio. I'm just gonna be casting magic around here. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. Oh, dude, that's so cool. Wow. Alright, so I guess... Okay, we can't go that way. Well, what is this? Better charge my controller. Well, if it dies, I'll just have to cut the video. So hopefully, we don't deal have to deal with that anytime soon. Damn. So, Revelio. Is there nothing else around here? This is some kind of puzzle. Where are you going? Are you just flying around? Oh, I can just... Is this going to be a trial and error? So this is some kind of puzzle, for sure. Okay. What? I don't know what to do here. There might be another one of these somewhere. <laughs> this is getting me nowhere, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, okay, that was pointless. All right. I'll figure it out. Ah. Sorry. Anything up here? Oh, there's another one. Wow. Ah. Yeah, we're gonna have to deal with this later. Oh, okay. We can go. We can leave through here. Whoa, wow, what is this? Rebellion. Wyvern Fountain. This, this fountain in the Transfiguration Courtyard has a likeness of a wyvern on top and serves as a relaxing place for students to gather. Despite rumors to the contrary, possibly started by Sir Catagon, this is most assertedly not meant to be a wyvern of way, slain by the lively knight in spite of himself. I hope I read that right. Probably messed it up. Okay, we're leveling up. So, I'm still kind of in the way. I'm wondering, is this a better spot? No, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna keep the face cam right here. I feel like that's a pretty solid spot for it. Revelio. 
Revelio. Nothing there. So more flu, more fast travel. That's cool. Wow, dude, just look at this architecture. There's a gargoyle talking. What? Where? What's over here? Revelio. Lumos. Oh, that's awesome. Wow. Can I go? Oh, watch the tile under your feet. You'll set off a something foul. Oh, please be careful. <laughs> I want to find the talking, talking gargoyle. Where is he? I got to go up there. What the? Oh, this classroom is awesome. Is that all you've got? Let me also! Professor Hackett! Oh, no. Perhaps you'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces in your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, wow. you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. To the wise, age matters very little. Today, we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Levioso. Levioso? A levitation charm? Levioso! A surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? One thing I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity, especially in the heat of battle. Now, Let's practice what we've just learned, starting with something small. Steady your want? Okay. Nice. We learned it that quick, huh? Levioso. Oh, that's awesome. No, it's love your song. Now, let's try something a little larger. Okay, I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> Let us begin with a basic cast. Okay. See how the dummy deflected your cast? Yep. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. Remember, a surprised opponent is a weak opponent, as Master Proof. Levioso. Good. Dude. Now, the basic cast. Well done. Wow. That's awesome. Very good. But the best way to practice is by dueling. We'll start with you two. Duelists, take your marks. Time for a proper Hogwarts welcome. Now, <laughs> I want a fair duel using only Levioso, basic cast, and Protego. You may begin. Okay. Protego. Oh, You're dude. good. Levioso, accepted. I know. <laughs> lucky. Nothing lucky about it. Stupid. Levioso. Oh. 
<laughs> I feel like I'm playing Mortal Kombat right now. Let's just oh. say I'm a quick learner. It's like a weird version of sumo wrestling. Not bad for a beginner. Yeah. You give as good as you get. <laughs> Thank you. What a compliment. He's so proud of himself. I put you on the spot, and you rose to the challenge. Points to Ravenclaw. Thank you, Professor Hackett. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. A classroom duel is one thing, but battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelows entirely. Understood, Professor. Yep. So, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, well done to Sure you will. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. Let's go. All right. That's enough spectacle for one day. Class is dismissed. Nice work. Talk to Sebastian. I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Practice? It felt more like I was dueling an expert. Wow, this guy's actually kind of nice. Sebastian Sallow, by the way. Didn't expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. Then again, didn't expect him to be so humble. Perhaps this wasn't your first duel. Um, it was. Never used my wand in combat. So this is just like a... I've had my share of wand combat. Wow. Alright. In fact, it was. Perhaps I have a knack for it. Be coy if you like, but I know better. Magic requires intention and talent. You know, you might be a perfect fit for Actually, that was a lie. I literally fought unsanctioned jewel giant stone knights already. And did really well. I, I just straight up lied. You know, you might be perfect fit for a certain exclusive unsanctioned dueling organization. <laughs> wow, so talking to this guy, I'm already getting into shady shit. <laughs> Sounds intriguing. <laughs> exclusive and unsanctioned. Count me in. Excellent. Knew I was right about you. If you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. Whether it's joining oh. a secret dueling club or sneaking into the restricted section of the library, you just have to be clever enough not to Hogwarts get Hogwarts holds Thank many you, secrets. I'm I'll sure. keep that in mind. Good. So pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps yeah. somewhere unsanctioned. <laughs> we'll see if perhaps somewhere a little unsanctioned. Actual skill. Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. If you're interested. Okay. Till All next right. time. Huh. Always thought Levioso was for first years. Not anymore. Well, we leveled up. What did we oh, unlock? Okay. Side quests are now available. Can be found inside regions of Hogwarts marked as flags and discovered by exploring the world. These quests reward XP but do not advance the main story. Okay. So that's like a side thing then, right? My young friend. So level two. Attend charms class. So this is side crossed wands. I should speak with Lucan Brattleby about the secret dueling club. I'll just focus on the, this main task, but we're definitely going to have to check that out for sure. And quests. Legendary gloves. Completed main quest. Got some glasses. Okay. Notes, resources. Sort alphabetically. Oh, gear. Duh. Handwear. So we got some gloves. Is that it? Am I 
missing something? Okay. Just kind of, kind of look at what's flying mounts, broom upgrades. Wow, wand handles. Health, defense. So I could have swore I just got some gloves. So if we go to... Oh wait, it was uh, in quest. Gear appearance reward. Okay. I'm sorry, I'm a little... Uh, I'm a little stupid. Those actually look pretty sick. So I think we learned how to like maybe change how our things look, still maintain the same uh, Off on characteristics. So we? we'll learn more about that later. Wow, dude, this castle is just so awesome. Don't mind if I do. Dude, where's that gargoyle? Oh my god, that is so cool. It's horrible, but why would they have this? That's kind of crazy. I like that, but at the same time, it's so dark. So, do I need to go all the way up here? Whoops. Excuse me. Probably shouldn't just be bolting around, but... Professor Ronan tends to go on a bit. We sometimes have to remind him to finish the lesson. Charms class? Let's go. Here. Behind you. There is an open seat here. Thank you. Hello, I am Nettie. So you are the new student. Have you met Professor Ronan yet? <clears throat> Shall we begin? <laughs> Welcome to year five of Chant. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work, but I am confident that we will take hold with a passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right? Now, everyone, please right. open your textbooks to page 517. But before we begin, can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the color change and growth charms? Anyone? Anyone? Hmm? Ah, 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 ah. I am afraid it is too late to study now. Hmm. My, the summer months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing obliviate on one another. <laughs> uh, hmm. Do you even oh. remember how to perform a basic summoning charm? Hmm? Hmm. Well, it seems that we are in dire need of review. Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. Accio. Okay. Wow. I feel like I messed that up, but we still got it. Accio. Wow. Pull stuff. Dude. That is not bad. It's life changing. You are a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. You might just rival Miss Onai here. Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. Excuse me. Well, as you all seem to have the basics That's now, it. and it is an exceptionally lovely day, I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. After me. Hell yeah, dude. Do some field work. Explore a little bit. Get some fresh air, dude. Oh, this is awesome. Ah. <sighs> 
I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree. Hmm? <laughs> yep. So, what better than a bit of sport to put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test, right? <laughs> Whoa. Oh, my God. <laughs> so, why don't we have our newest nice. student start us off? Hmm? What do I gotta do here? Just pull the ball as close as possible. That's pretty sweet. Very simple. Summoning charm. Cast Accio oh. on one of the spheres and relinquish your charm at the last possible moment. Now, okay. uh, think of this like gobstones, if you will. But instead of throwing the marbles out, you are summoning them toward right. you. Akio, this is to pull the sphere as... Splendid! Don't lose oh. your composure. It's a little bit harder than, it, than I thought it would be. Very good. Okay, so it still rolls. It still keeps rolling. It doesn't just stop in place. Akio. That's it! Okay, cool. We got it. Very good! Points to Ravenclaw! But there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. Miss Onai, would you care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? Come on up! I don't expect to beat her. You'll be the blues, just as before, and Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? Yes, sir. Okay. Let us oh my god, she's a pro. There we go. Akio. <laughs> Wow. So you gotta let go right around in the middle. So maybe I can no, oh, I want I want that one. Maybe I can knock her ball off. Not quite. Not quite enough there. Oh that sucks. Well done. Here we go. Oh, she's gonna knock mine right off. Okay. That is how it's done. Okay, I think I got to knock mine and try to knock hers off. Awesome. Oh, I, oh my God, I'm horrible. Very good. I'm horrible. Damn it! I knew she was gonna win. She's like perfect. Honestly. Let's make this a bit more interesting, shall we? Oh, dude. <laughs> I think we are well past interesting at this point. Yeah. I'll say. Enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. This round this is so settles cool. it all. What? Oh. Only 30, really? Let's wait for the perfect moment here. Nice. No, don't fall. Excellent control there. Perfect. Let us see this. What is she doing? There we go. Okay, I'll go for this one now. Nice. Brilliant. Why is she... Dude, she's going this easy on me. Done. She must be. Oh, I gotta wait now. I would have had time before, now not so much. Okay, sweet. A perfect score. Remarkable. <laughs> hey. 
Hell yeah. Very good, both of you. Well done. That was kind of fun. I hope there's a lot more stuff like that in the game. Class is dismissed. Gather your things on the way out. Good game back there. I must admit, I think I underestimated you. Took you me weeks no, yeah, to become you, proficient with You went easily on me, that's for sure. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. I'd hope so. I'm glad you understand. That's good to hear. It's a lot to take in all at once. To put it lightly, I remember how I felt when I first arrived. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. Wagadu? My mother received an offer to teach divination here. Oh my before god. I knew it, we Wagadu. Had left Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. How big is. Is Wagadu much bigger than Hogwarts? <laughs> Wagadu School of Magic is the largest wizarding school in the world. So, yes, bigger than Hogwarts. But it oh, that's never awesome. seemed intimidating or overwhelming to me. It always felt like home. I kind of want to go there now, dude. Is... Alright, I'm... As much as I want to learn about this place... It's nice to learn about another wizarding school. I just, Thank you for I just asking. can't with the name. I, can't. I do miss Wagadu, but I am glad to be here at Hogwarts. Oh my god, ah, I'm so stupid. I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. Better not keep him waiting. Until next time. Better not keep them waiting. Of course, you can use Akio on humans, if you're so inclined. Well, you'd be using it on clothing, to be precise. A word, you. if you would. You know it won't work on humans. You wanted to speak with me, Professor? I did. That's interesting. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation? Well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? You did well, managing to best as gifted a student as Miss Onai. Thank you, Professor. I enjoyed the match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor, though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Expect to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for you. Sweet. Oh, so what now? Quest complete, charms class. Leveling Hello? up. How was your first day coming along? Is there a chest up here? Or a... accidentally levitated Professor Ronan's sandwich once. <laughs> he was fine about it. <laughs> accidentally <laughs> levitated a sandwich the other day. And then the All right. I've always said we'll have to check, um, What's going on here? Quest. Meet with Professor Weasley. Okay. Might wanna. Where is the mind? Where were you in the Goblin Rebellion of Dude, that guy's pondering an orb too. Wow, dude. So many wizards pondering in here. Another cloak. Oh. Oh, I can pet the cat. I didn't even see the cat. I tried to mess with that globe. Okay, this game is officially 10 out of 10. <laughs> no. What is this? She says it's a boo, and he says it's a flat. Thieves, enough. You'll get us all detained. All right, I'm going to have to... Flew out of here, you know what I mean? If you know what I mean. So, is this area... This area is in the movies, right? Dude, that's so awesome. Oh my god, another cat. Oh my god. Why do they gotta do this to me? I'm never gonna get anywhere. I love cats.
quest begin. Damn. All right, guys. Well, unfortunately, um, I don't have any more time for this game right now. Um, I really hope you guys enjoyed watching me play through the prologue and, you know, the beginning of the game. Um, and if you enjoyed the video, please remember to leave a like and consider subscribing if you want to keep seeing more content like this. And I hope I see you guys in the next one.